Hello everyone, I hope you all are doing good. This video I'm going to create on request coming from Leon from Singapore who is one of my subscribers and he has also messaged me personally on Instagram and he has a request that he wants to send a message on multiple uh, telegram groups okay so it's more like a broadcasting which he wants to do on multiple groups and he wanted to know how to do it he has already seen uh, my previous video in which i have shown uh, how to send a message on any telegram group and in this video i'm going to show you how you can broadcast the message to multiple groups and before we move forward thank you so much for subscribing and making it a uh, you know family of 5000 plus subscribers so thank you so much for that now to move ahead in this tutorial first thing which i have done is i have created a group of you know i have created three groups actually just for the demonstration purpose so i have group a b and group c and all of these groups are new groups uh, which i have created and uh, we just basically have two members in this so just a demo group okay and now if you see this is the program which is going to send or broadcast message to all these groups so the important thing here is that we need to know group IDs or chat ID you can say for all the groups. Okay, so if you see here I have created a variable uh, which is a list and which is having all the three uh, chat IDs. Okay, so chat IDs is basically unique to per group or per you know any chat basically. Uh, so all of these three I have stored here and then uh, after this basically all of the other thing is pretty much straightforward and it's gonna be same uh, how we have done in previous uh, how I have shown you how we uh, sent a message to one group in a previous video okay so we have created a function which is called broadcast message and in this broadcast message we are passing list of all the groups okay so this is the uh, list of all the groups which we are passing here and also we are passing the message which we want to send okay so in this example let's say we want to uh, broadcast this message that iPhone prices have reduced by 10% go and grab them now okay so this is the message which we want to uh, which we want to send so now the one change you will see here is that we are now creating a loop and we are looping through all the items which is there in the group okay so we are looping through all the chat IDs uh, which are available here that's the reason we are using for loop and other than that uh, it's again going to be same so we are making three requests in this case to broadcast message to all the groups okay so this syntax is pretty much straightforward so i'm not going to go into detail of this uh, i hope you have already watched my previous video and uh, it's just going to be you know short video is going to explain uh, how to broadcast message here okay so now if you uh, see in first two lines we already uh, defined and created a list of groups and message which we want to send and then we are calling this function broadcast message and passing list of groups and the message which we want to send okay and in there and i'm just printing something just to you know let you know visually that program has finished and here also i'm printing response dot text you don't really need to do it you can uh, remove it as well but uh, we just want to see what is the you know what what has been happening if there is any error we'll be able to see that in the response uh, dot text okay uh, so right now just you can see here again we do not have any messages here in any of these groups and now I'm gonna run this program and let's see what happens so I have ran it and it seems to be okay so it seems it has created three requests this is one and this is second one and then this last one is the third one okay so let's go ahead and see here okay now we can see in the groups okay group a b and c all of these three groups seems to have the same message okay which means we have been successfully able to broadcast message to all the three groups okay so i have not shown you how you can get the group ids from all the groups because i have already shown you how to you know get uh, updates from your bot and uh, you need to run basically get update by calling your bot and your bot is going to be giving you id of all the you know uh, groups which you are part of so thank you so much for uh, watching the video if you have any query uh, please feel free to write in comment box or if you have some personal request or you know if you want uh, me to make any video on certain topic which is probably going to help you in some way in that case you can either comment here or you can also message me on instagram i'll be more than happy to assist you thank you so much for watching see you again in the next video